Hey everyone, in this video I will show you how you can make your own light bulb using just some concepts of CSS and JavaScript. So as you can see on my screen, I have made this one and if you click on this switch, it is turned off and I click on this, the bulb glows and the switch turns on and when I click it again, the bulb turns off and the switch goes to the normal position. So in this video I will be explaining you how you can make this on your own and it is very simple if you know some concept of JavaScript like toggle and some concept of CSS. So without wasting any more time, let's go. Okay, so I am on my VS code and I have opened my HTML file on of bulb.html and I have three images. First is the light bulb, second is the off switch and third is the on switch. So, without any wasting any more time, let's add the boilerplate, then add the style tag, which will be useful later, and then the script tag, okay, we need them later, then the main body content, first we will add a div, inside which we add a image, and a p element, let's give the image id, what bulb and this id glow this uh, the element this um, which i have added the p it will work as glow okay and okay so i have added some more images and this one will be light switch the off switch and this one will be the on switch and I have not given this so let's give this big light okay so yeah and then first of all let's give some styling margin 0 padding also 0 okay then body then we will change the background color of the body uh, we will make some grayish color okay then we will target the div position will be absolute then from top we will give 47 percent from left from left we will give 47 percent and yeah that's it and then we will go to the images first of all the bulb width will be 15 vnim then also we have to do this for same uh, for the off and on button then width um, 15 vnim and then we will copy this for the on button on button okay and then we will give this some um, the position will be absolute then from top we will give some space let's say wait wait let's say 70 percent from left let's say three percent and then we will copy this and add in this one and now we have to create also a glow okay styling for the glow glow button or you can say the glow tag so let's add this let's give it a width of i'm um, like what v7 vnim and height also 7 vnim then border radius will be 100 pixels so we want right the matlab um, we want a round circle and then add some this and then what we will do we will do the absolute okay so we have done a lot of things so let's hit the go live button and see what is going on <clears throat> okay okay so okay i have not given the width for the on off button so let's add that first
Oops. <laughs> okay. All right. Oh yes. I have not given the IDs, so yeah. The off button and the on button, okay. So I think this will work. Yes. And now we need to about 15 and 15 yep this looks great and then what we will do next is um, place the bulb uh, before that let's um, some increase the height and width yeah this looks fine okay so from top let's say minus 5 minus five percent yep and from left let's say minus six percent okay so minus 25 yep minus 29 yep minus 33 will be great yes and as you can see it is fully responsive okay okay so most of the part is done and now what is left is because okay, so first of all before adding going to the javascript let's add the z index 11 so this will do a lot of work you will see later so yes first of all let's target the off button so when someone will click on it the light bulb will glow Okay, so get element by id off then add event listener then we will add click and then we will add a function and then we will add this okay get element by id off and dot class list dot wait class list dot toggle dot active okay and then we will need two more for the on button and for the glow button okay so yeah, most of the work is done and now what we need is add the active elements okay so opacity will be zero for the first one and dot active wait we need opacity to be 1 then the opacity will be 1 and then on the active one the opacity will be 0 and now the glow now the glow one okay so background color white box shadow let's add 0 pixel 0 pixel 100 pixel 100 pixel white and let's remove this so yeah i think we are done oops Oops. see we are done when you click on the switch it turns on and again it turns off so yeah, as you can see it is fully responsive this is will work okay how beautiful it looks and when you inspect it let's check the responsiveness you know see it looks very cool you know 
so yeah this is the video of the tutorial of how you can make your own on off bulb with just simple javascript concepts and some styling with the help of css and yeah this is all for it for this video i hope you like this tutorial and if you do like this video comment what you want next and do subscribe if you are not subscribed i will make very much content soon so yeah hit the like button and i will see you on the next one